Okay, so today we have Crass and I Ain't Thick. It's just a trick. Uh, I haven't listened to Crass. Well, I've listened to them, you know, but I haven't reacted to Crass in a while. And uh, I figured, why the heck not? They've been requested all the time. And uh, they're a band that I found through this channel because of, you know, like I said, uh, recommendations. Uh, so, yeah, I'm excited to get back into Crass today, see what they're talking about. Uh, so let's get into it and let's just go. Oh, yeah. Steve Ignorant on vocals, of course. I mean, nobody else sounds like him. Um, just, I mean, in your face. 
uh, you know, you know, just whipping up lyrics everywhere, uh, you know, firing off lyrics, I guess you could say as well. Um, you know, just to follow along, it was hard. Um, you know, because obviously he's, his accent, his voice, everything is just like, and I know somebody also before, I think I said before as well, but, um, you know, said, you know, why do you laugh when you listen to Crass? It's just because Steve's voice is so, you, I mean, I hate the word unique, but it's so, you know, even for punk, it's just so different and he just has so much, you know, uh, I was, you know, swagger, I guess you could say he has so much, you know, he just doesn't care. I mean, I guess you would say as well. It's just, I mean, he's a one of a kind singer if you could call him a singer, uh, and, uh, just, I mean, so much attitude, I mean, holy frig, um, and just the, oh, yeah, you know, that's gonna be in my head as well, you know, and how we saying, you know, oh, yeah, it's just like, oh, yeah, you want to come at me, that's what I feel like, you know, uh, you know, just, oh, yeah, you want to mess with me, whatever, I'm not gonna be part of your whole little scheme here, uh, so I just really enjoyed it, and I also, one minute here, I just wanted to look up the, uh, personnel again here, uh, because, I, you know, every time I listen to a, cra a crass, I was gonna say crash, a crass song, um, the drumming is always, you know, so well as well, you know, so good as well, because, you know, again, when I'm talking about, you know, Steve Ignorant here, I know, uh, you know, as well, it's just like, you know, his voice, you know, it takes, you know, so much space in my, in my head anyway, because, you know, I'm just trying to pay attention to what he's saying. And again, he has so much attitude and he's just roaring, you know, the roaring verses and everything, uh, just, you know, coming at you. Um, but on drums here, Penny, uh, I forget if it's Rimba or Rimbo, and I can't remember, but anyway, Penny on the drums, you know, he's so quick. He's so, he has so much attitude as well. You can just feel it from the, through the drums. He has so much style. Uh, and I just love, you know, again, like I said, he's just very quick and, uh, it just fits so well. I mean, as well on, uh, you know, the, uh, feel free, like that feel free on lead guitar, rhythm guitar, N.A. Palmer, Pete Wright on bass guitar, uh, and then Penny, like I said, on drums. It's just like this band was so quick. They were so, oh God. I mean, again, so full of attitude. They just, I, they did not care. They didn't give a shit, I guess you could say. And maybe they did, but I mean, the music is just like, my God, you know, and the chorus here as well. You know, how the song starts off with, you, you know, the, oh yeah, well, I've got it all up here, C. Oh yeah, oh yeah. When they think they've got it all out there, C, they can F off because they ain't got me. They ain't going to buy my Dignity. And, you know, let me tell you, I've got it all up here. And it's just like, you know, it's just like, you know, how he's saying, you know, how he's basically, he's ready for a fight. It sounds like, you know, somebody, he's just ready to go. It seems like all the time, you know, Steve Ignorant anyway, with his vocals is just like, you know, oh yeah, you know, they think they got me, but they don't. And it's just like, holy frig. It's just like, nobody was talking to you, Steve, um, but he's just going at you. Um, anyway, and then, you know, I don't, I'm not even going to really try to read all these lyrics because, again, it's just like, I, you know, it just, I mean, they're coming at you so hard, but, you know, just with some parts, I guess I'll say, uh, try to get me with a TV show, but I wouldn't have none of it. No, no, no. Standards and values on a black and white screen. Sarah Farrah Fawcett acting mean. She's got that a lot. She's got the lot. That's what they want you to think. Read between the lines. You know, he kept saying, read between the lines. She's just an effing puppet. Uh, it's just, <laughs> it's just like, my God. Uh, it's just like, he's just going at everybody. Uh, uh, in their indoctrination plan, be like me, girls, and become a real man. Uh, live to the full. Always act flash. Don't use your brains when your body makes the splash. You know, and again, that's the whole thing we're saying. Basically, when you're saying, uh, well, I've got it all. Got, got it all up here, I guess, you know, I would think referencing to his brain, um, when they think they've got all out, see, they can F off, because they ain't got me, can't buy my dignity, you know, he's true to himself, uh, you know, talking about the supermarket, and this, it just, I mean, something as a supermarket store, where it's just like, you know, you go to buy groceries, whatever, and how he's just saying, you know, how he sees it, you know, you, they want you to buy more and more and more, it's just like mountains of crap, and nobody really needs, it's just like, you know, if you want to buy this, you know, you, you don't, don't ask Steve, um, you know, do you want to buy this for this much more money or whatever? Uh, you know, be a happy family like the people on the pack pay off the profit and you'll never look back. And he's just like, he's just, he's like, I see everything that's going on here. He's just like, I know what's happening. Uh, and then, you know, I like, I'm going to go to the, I think it was last verse. No, it was the second last, I guess. But when he says, you know, try to get me with religion and with Christ said, I'd go to heaven if I act real nice. But they were just preparing a crucifix for me, a life of guilt, of sin, of pain, of holy misery. They've got the lot. Uh, I like how they've got the lot. It's just like, my goodness, uh, the slang all over here. That's what they want you to think. Read between the lines. You'll see the missing link. So we kept repeating that as well. The missing link and read between the lines. The Bible is just a blueprint for the morality scene. Just another load of shit on how it's never been. <laughs> uh, they stand there in their pulpit, uh, doling out their lives, offering forgiveness. Then they talk of eyes for eyes. So again, you know, the whole religion thing, 
I mean, yeah, I would imagine that Steve uh, has a problem with that as well, and he does, and uh, so do I. So I, I really appreciate all that, uh, you know, and then try to get me, but I won't be got saying I'm a misfit, but I say I'm not. So it's just like, you know, you say what I am, but I'll say what I'm not. You know, I like that. I say I'm a misfit, but I say I'm not. Just probably, again, you're talking about here with punks and such, you know, and even, um, I think I think it was Crass where they said they don't like being called a punk band. I can't remember if it was Crass or not. But either way, uh, you know, say I'm a misfit, but I say I'm not. I just like that line a lot. Um, and I like the Misfits as well, another great punk band. Anyway, I never set out to profit from another, those smarmy bastards who steal from their mother. So again, you know, all these people, you know, saying that's, you know, again, talking about this scene, you know, back in the late 70s, you know, with punk and everything like that. It's saying, you know, like, oh, those punks, you know, they're, they're terrible, you know, they'll, they'll steal from me. But those people that are talking would steal from their own mother, that's what I'm getting. Um, anyway, and then going on, you know, uh, acceptance of normality is what they want you as proof, is what... The, they want from you as proof. They think they've got the answers, but there's something that they miss. Their cup, <laughs> which overfloweth, is just full up of piss. And then, you know, the obviously the more uh, friggin' attitude he puts into those lines, you know, it's just full up of piss. And then, you know, the oh yes at the end, they can F off because they ain't got me. Uh, so I, I just, he's really truly telling it, telling it like it is. And I mean, the song, I don't think it ages, you know, I mean, you're always going to feel, you know, like you can relate to all of this. I mean, it's only gotten, you know, talking about, you know, the supermarkets, the prices have gone up, everything's gone up, uh, the religion stuff, I mean, yeah, it's just like, it's all, you know, he's, he's still relatable, obviously, and uh, if you've come across, you know, like I did, I guess, uh, coming across crass, and coming across Steve Ignorance, just uncanny vocals, um, it, it's, a, it's a great feeling, and uh, it's just like, you know, it's just like, my God, uh, these lyrics, you know, now, some people might not like the way they're delivered, they might not like how he sings, whatever, but um, the lyrics are always there. The lyrics are, I mean, they're always, you know, so, you know, I, it's just so eye-opening, I guess you would say. But um, I love Steve Wigner's vocals. I think he's fun. I think he's great. Uh, I just love the attitude. I love everything about it. And uh, again, like I said, I really love Penny on the drums, too. That's the two guys right there that just, I don't know, every time I listen to Crass, I just, they're unmissable. And uh, not, nothing to say about the other guys in the band, but I just love them. Anyway, uh, <laughs> I guess that's all I gotta say. I, again, the lyrics, are, it's so hard to read these lyrics because, again, the slang and just the way that, you know, they're written from, you know, this band and how Steve delivers them, it's hard to, you know, keep up with his lyrics, even just reading them, you know, aloud. Uh, but anyway, you know, I just love it all. And uh, so many, like I said, just so many words in the song. I'd like to know how many words were in the freaking song. Um, it's just like, my God, but again, he's going so fast. Uh, but yeah, so much so much going on here. I really enjoyed it. Uh, so much attitude, really. And uh, just really thought it was great. Um, and just, you know, don't mess around with, you know, Steve. He's, you know, really that's what comes down to it. Don't mess around the, don't mess around with craft, craft. Oh my God, with crass. It says in the, you know, the title, I ain't thick. It's just a trick. You know, I ain't dumb. You know, it's just a trick. Uh, and again, how people kind of just, just again, just to end it off, I guess with that, uh, how to say, you know, it doesn't matter what the person looks like, you know, you know, what's it called? Um, freaking uh don't judge a book by its cover there it is uh and it's just like you know some people just think somebody's dumb or somebody's this or that just because of the way they look it's just like you gotta you know explore you gotta talk to that person anyway uh and that's you know a great meaning you know to leave off of a uh, message to leave off of so anyway i guess that's all i gotta say uh again this was just i mean every time i listen to crass it's just like it's hard i don't it's hard to explain stuff because it's just like again the words are just you know I, I there's always so many things to talk about because of the lyrics and what they're talking about and you know the powerful you know the power that it all has it's just like it's hard to uh explain in like 15 minutes but anyway that's it uh thanks for watching thanks for liking subscribing commenting all that stuff really appreciate all the support just know that i love this song and that oh yeah oh yeah is probably going to be in my head all night and uh i just love the passion here uh they can fuck off because they ain't got me they get they can't buy my dignity it, dignity it's just like my goodness anyway thanks again for watching i'll talk to you guys again soon